How's it going everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Robin and this is my channel Oracle Rising. So I wanted to talk to you today about um, manifesting and maybe looking for some signs that your manifestation is close to you because sometimes you know things are happening in the background and you just have no idea if the universe heard you. First of all the universe always hears you guys so don't worry about it but you may be looking for some kind of indication or clues that your manifestation is close to you. So I've got a little bit of a list here. I've got seven signs. So the first one, and this is really important, um, is your dreams. Sometimes things happen in your dreams and they might not necessarily relate to the thing that you're asking for. So you might have to go and interpret your dream. There's all kinds of websites. Um, one of my favorites is the Dream Dictionary. Just go pop in some keywords from your weird dream. You'd be a little bit surprised at what comes out for you. Um, so if you have something that's particularly memorably weird come to you while you're sleeping, make a note of it and check it out the next day because chances are there's a really good clue there for you um, that your manifestation is very close. So the second one that I have for you that signs that your manifestation is is near is feeling at ease you know um, sometimes there can be some real anxiety related to like why are things not happening right now what's taking so long and just feel like really angsty and anxious and um, trying to hurry along the universe and then you might all of a sudden just wake up one day and feel like okay well everything's under control and the universe has my back and you're just feeling really comfortable and feeling full of trust and so that's a really good sign that your manifestation is really getting close to um, becoming part of your 3D reality so that's I really like that one. So the third one is having tower moments so um, you know I have a tarot card reading um, channel as well so the tower it represents a moment of being shaken up and this will happen for you um, and it could be anything, you know, um, something going wrong, wrong at work, like having a fight with your spouse or, um, you know, witnessing a car accident, something that's going to really sort of shake you up a little bit. Um, but it, what it does is actually remember, like it reminds you of how strong your foundation is and what you're made of. And then confidence can come back out of that and realizing that you can really count on yourself. So a tower moment coming in for you can really sort of readjust the any sort of calamity that you might be experiencing. So really like be grateful for all these things that feel like obstacles because it's not. It's not you being off your path. It's you being on your path. So kind of tweak how you look at um, I got the word injustice or you know something that's really uncomfortable so the fourth sign that your manifestation is close to you is to see angel numbers now this is a really big one and this is angel numbers are repeating numbers and it can be groups of the same number or numbers that you see like let's just take for example four five six like if you're walking along the street and you kind of go that route every day and then all of a sudden a house number jumps out at, at you and this is just one example and you're like well I, I don't remember seeing this number before so why is it all of a sudden popping out like go and like remember that number and then when you're at a computer or you have your phone and you can access a website go ahead and check out what that number means and all you have to do is type in angel number blah 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 it'll come up with the interpretation of what the angels are trying to say to you so it's always a really good sign a big one is 1111 um, that one really has a life of its own and the 1111 is to remind you to keep your thoughts like really positive and uplifted in order to um, be in prime manifestation mode so I really like that one for you so the fifth sign I have here for you guys is feelings of deja vu. So if you guys have ever watched The Matrix, um, a deja vu, it feels like a glitch in The Matrix. And it's like um, seeing or experiencing the same thing or having a feeling that you've met somebody before. 
and you've met them for the first time that day or like you've been to that new place before it's just the feeling that something is repeating itself but it's actually something that you've never done before so this could be something that your higher self has given you a vision of when you started on your manifestation journey and so now you're getting close to it so you're having these um recognitions these remembrances of something that hasn't even happened yet so this is a really cool one so whenever you get that feeling of deja vu again people call it um a goose walked over my grave like there's or you could get goosebumps like that's another um way of feeling like things are about to happen and you could call that precognizing because you're seeing something that hasn't happened yet but your higher self already knows so it's giving you a little bit of a clue that way so that one's a really good one too um so okay so the sixth sign that i have for you is actually vibrating people out of your life so when you start to um, sort of purify your vibration people that don't match it anymore will start to drop off so if you've been losing friends or there's people in your family that you no longer connect with or you know it could be anybody it could be a co-worker as you start to ascend towards higher aspects of love and having high vibrations of love is what is going to attract in the ultimate level of abundance for you then people that no longer match that, um, that are in low level vibrations, they're gonna start to disappear from your life. And that's to make way for new and better people and new and better experiences for you so that you can bring in love and abundance. So um, that's a really, really good sign. When, when people start to drop off, it's for your benefit. It's the universe removing people that no longer serve you or the um, height of vibration where you belong and where you want to be. Because when you're expressing love, that is like the golden doorway to manifestation. So guys, I think that's a really good one too, but feel free to make comments, guys. Um, and the last sign, your manifestation is, is close, and this is just my list, other people have lists too, is synchronicities. So if you're trying to manifest a new car and you have it in your mind what you're wishing to see in your driveway, um, you'll start seeing models of that car or you start seeing ads or something like people talking about it. So if you're seeing things come up in like advertising on a billboard or you're overhearing people um, talking about the thing that you are working your law of attraction for that is such a good sign it's like it's almost there so it's like the universe sort of whispering through clues that you might kind of think well that's just a coincidence like replace the word coincidence with synchronicity and you'll understand that you're just being prepared to receive that in your reality so i think that's one of my favorite ones and it can really also kind of give you the feeling of deja vu so you'll know that it's really close and just be ready to receive and that's all just such an important thing too you guys is to be ready to receive that blessing from the universe that you worked so hard to attain right so interesting list you guys and feel free to let me know what your favorite clues are that your manifestation is is close and thanks so much for tuning in and please tap the subscribe bell, bell you guys so i can reach more people and keep my channel going so anyway sending love you guys take care bye for now